Hey y'all, hey. So we are back with another re reaction video. Watch with me, movie time type deal. So uh, go ahead and get your popcorn ready because this one gonna be long, okay? Fall in love with me. I introduce her to the game and let her talk with me. See me like Bunny and Clyde, she even clutching me. I feel like it's do or die, she give her soul to me. She wanna be close to me. Oh, she say she fuck with me the long way. Y'all, I'm so mad at myself. I got halfway through this goddamn video and didn't hit the record button. Well, okay, I didn't get halfway, but I got a little ways in. But anyway, redo, rewind. We are reacting to the body cam footage of the pastor, Pastor Jennings. I did my reaction on the little short clip version. Shit was still funny to me, but I found the body cam footage and I was like, oh shit, I want to see this. But then I was like, let me just watch it with my viewers, right? Let me just watch it with y'all so we can watch it together. It could be like a little movie night, little movie deal. Okay, so get you some popcorn. I got coffee. I drink coffee late at night. Don't judge me. A cup of ice per usual and uh, the good vape pen. So this one a little lengthy. The video is 20 minutes long. I'm going to try not to stop it as much, but y'all know me. If I got something to say, I'm going to stop it and say it. Okay? So before you get to clicking off this video, because I can feel you itching to click off. I see you. I see you wanting to click off. Stop that. Hit the subscribe button instead. Stop being so impatient. We're going to get through this. You're going to be all right. Y'all know y'all watch movies on YouTube all day anyway. So it's going to be all right. But I want to go through this here body cam footage because I got to see this. I, I got to see the whole thing play out. Okay, so we recording. Bam. Howdy. Hey, man. How's it going? Pretty good. What you doing here, man? What it look like he doing? Are right, they saying that is that your vehicle? No. It's not. It's the neighbor's vehicle. The neighbors? Three fourteen. I'll be on thirteen. Okay. You live here? No, I don't live here. Okay. Uh, they saying that this vehicle is not supposed to be here, and you're not supposed to be Who's here. Who's saying it? They called about it. I don't know who called. I'm supposed to be here. I'm Pastor Jennings. I live across the street. You're Pastor Jennings? Yes. I'm looking out for their house while they gone. Okay. Uh, Water and they fly. Okay. Well, that's cool. Do you have like ID and all? Oh, no, man. I'm not going to be you no know, ID. Why not? I ain't did nothing wrong. And did well, you look, listen, listen, I'm not saying do nothing wrong. Doc, listen, There's a suspicious I person. Gonna, look, I used to be a police officer in good water. Don't come in. Hey, <laughs> I already know what's up. Look, look man, man, don't do this bullshit to me. now. You, there's a suspicious person in the I do have to pause because a lot of people like don't really get to know their neighbors, especially in the South. Like I saw that uh, comment. Uh, damn, she gonna kill. Me. God, she gonna kill me. Tawana. God damn, I was like, why I can't think of her name? But a lot of people don't talk to their neighbors because of shit like this. Me personally, I prefer talking to my neighbors. It really depends on where you at in the world because. If your neighbors are good neighbors like mine are, talking to your neighbors is beneficial. Like, all my neighbors around me, we look out for each other. Like, if it wasn't for, y'all seen DJ. Okay, let me tell y'all something. DJ don't play that. <laughs> like, at all. Okay, so don't come messing with me or my house. So, in some cases, it's like the neighbors, like, you know. And then in Louisiana, my family from Louisiana. So, all the neighbors really family. Like this is some stuff we do like in Southern black culture, especially in the South, we do water each other's flowers and fucking feed each other dogs while we going out of town. But some people don't want to get to know their neighbors and that's completely understandable because you don't want to get caught up in no situation like this or any other situation for that matter. So I understand both sides of it. I know y'all are. Right. And if you're not one to identify yourself. I don't have to identify myself. Hold my peace, God. Hold it. No, no. I stop and identify state. That guy know me. He can't do my story that got broke in. I live right over there across the street. Who calls y'all? That's what we got to figure out. But yeah, first, who I. Calls? 
He here. don't live here. I'm not saying nothing about. You have no right to approach me if I ain't did nothing suspicious or nothing wrong. Told him I'm a pastor. I pastor until I don't hear you. You want to rock me up? Lock me up. Lock me I'm not showing y'all anything. That's all he want to do. I'm going to continue to water these flowers. I don't care who called y'all. Lock me up and see what happens. I want you to. Hey, man, just come here and talk to us. I'm going to water these back flowers. He is determined to water them flowers. Well, if you would let us talk to him, we can figure stuff out. Up. This bullshit. We're, we're just trying to he talk to you, man. Come here. That's thing I hate about We got one that's not listening to him. Look, man, let me see your phone. Let me see your phone, dude. Just calm down, okay? No, no. So Stop. You took I like this. Phone, you gonna okay. Put We're just trying to talk to you and yeah, see. I don't, I'm not, I don't want to argue with you, okay? All right, yeah. go ahead and do what you got to do, Doc. Do, you do what you got to do. Go on and lock me up. It's already lost up. It's already lost up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Just have a seat, okay? Okay. I already lost up. Boy, he's going to fuck they life up. He is about to have all their badges. 313, show us. 1026, one black man. Sit, sit down. down sit down, down, man. Just, okay, let me call my wife. You're not calling nobody. My son just got racially profiled in uh, Michigan. He's got his master's degree. He's an athletic director. Three police profiler came in. I was ex-police officer. Good one. I told you I'm a pastor. Okay, look, man. I, uh, who called y'all? We, I don't have to ID myself. You will not I listen. I have a call on you. You have to identify yourself to me. Oh, you no, understand what no, I'm telling no. you? No, I don't. You wait to watch how you want. Take me down, book me. Go do what you need to do. Go do what you need to do. I think it's going to be this. Please come to quick. We're going to wait off. Okay, All right. so hold Will y'all sit with him, Jeremy? I'm going to go yeah, over here and sit with people again. There's a, um, a comment, actually, that I found intriguing in the um, this video, like the video that we're watching. I ain't put my phone on do not disturb. But there's a comment in the video. That's a from an actual police officer and it says as a police officer for 15 years i know how frustrating it is for someone in in a circumstance like this refuse to provide id however he is and this is in all caps not required to id himself if he is not under arrest all these officers needed to do was have the caller verify that he's okay to be there period one officer a couple questions to the caller clear scene that's it i agree I ain't got to identify myself to you. <laughs> this ain't a traffic stop. You rolled up on me. I told you my name, Pastor Jennings. Now, you didn't. I didn't need to give you my government name. I didn't want to give you my government name. I told you who I was. I told you what I was doing. That's the end of that. So all this aggression is just way too much. And if a, if a police officer can come in and say that, I can call my uncle, figure out the rules, do all that. But at this point, we all know officers do what the fuck they want to do anyway. They just be like, fuck protocol. At this point, they don't really have no guidance, no no discipline, none of that. They don't have that. They do what the fuck they want to do. So if the man don't want to ID himself, he wasn't even under arrest. Like, what are y'all arresting him for? Like, wh on what grounds are y'all arresting him? You can't just arrest somebody just because somebody called and said he looked like he doing something suspicious. When does that warrant arrest? <laughs> like, what the fuck? I could I could be outside watering DJs while I was a feeding his dog. So y'all y'all gonna arrest me because I'm feeding my neighbor's dog and that don't look right to y'all? Who are y'all to say what look right and what don't look right? You didn't catch me breaking in. You caught me watering flowers. Oh okay. Get a call. Three thirteen. Ben. Can you have the 72 that calls, step out and talk to her? Hello. Hello. Why should be a white person come outside? They finna make me see. They need to clean out their car. They shit dirty as fuck. This is the only part I low-key hate, is the part where it's like... Hey, you know what? You know what? 10-15. 10-15. 10-15. I ain't gonna sit there and have that, dude. Why? Because he's... No, they ain't letting nothing now. Hey, Jeremy, I ain't gonna sit there and have that. Hey, Jeremy, I ain't gonna sit there and have that. Hey, Jeremy, I ain't gonna sit there and have that. Hey, Jeremy, I ain't gonna sit there and have that. Hey, Jeremy, I ain't gonna sit there and have that. Hey, Jeremy, I ain't gonna sit there and have that.
one black male. Yeah. See, I don't like that either. Like, see, that's why I, I really hope I don't get arrested. Okay, I've been to jail before. I've been arrested before. And that was me. I went to jail because I was talking shit. Ultimately, that's why I went to jail. I was I was talking shit. And I wasn't going to back down from talking shit. It was an officer with his finger in my fucking face, yelling and spitting at me like we was on Beyond Scared Straight. My nigga, leave me the fuck alone. Get your finger out of my face. I don't play that shit. So I'm going to be the motherfucker that they're going to they gonna take to jail. Because I don't know how to shut the fuck up. Me and authority don't really get along. I don't do authority because I don't like to people telling me what to do. Especially when I don't fuck with you like that. I already don't like cops as it is. And I have to respect them because my uncle is a cop. But at the same time, I already don't like y'all. So me naturally, and I know how I can pop off. That would have been me. Y'all just going to take me to jail because I don't know how to shut up. <laughs> like I'm just not built that way I've been that way since I was a kid I always talk back to my mama and got the shit slapped out of me and I still did it because I'm the one person that's gonna say what the fuck I wanna say y'all watch my channel so y'all already know I say what the fuck I wanna say but that's me I don't like authority I don't like aggression I don't like none of that it's triggering I don't like it so we, you just gonna have to take me to jail I'm, fuck it I, we here <laughs> like we here you just gonna take me I don't give a fuck how stupid it sounds. I just, I don't know how to control my mouth. I don't. I got to get gas, so he needs to go on someone else. That or I'm just going to laugh at you, and that's just going to piss you off even more. Like how he was, like, giggling and shit. Like, it's, it's it like, in the clip we saw, I, I mean, that's I'm me. Gonna I'm, I'm going to piss you off, because I'm going to make you work. I mean, I saw the gold SUV, mm -hmm. so, and I saw him outside, and all I did is said, hey, man, do you live here? No. Nah. Is that your car? No, it's the neighbor's. So I'm finna go over here and run the tag. Then you go back and forth with cops, they dig themselves into a deeper hole. Oh no, sitting there. Because I already wrong to begin with. If you if you're a pastor and you hear water in the neighbor's yard, that's fine if you got permission. No trespassing. Okay, but did y'all call and see if he had Wait, permission? Y'all didn't even seven try out. to call. All y'all had to do was call the neighbor and ask, or call the owner of the house and ask. Y'all can figure out every fucking thing else, but y'all can't pick up a goddamn phone and ask a question? Who you talking on records? Come on now, that don't make no fucking sense. Uh-huh, you're up. Who you talking can you run a 28 for me? Hey, golden color Chevy Tahoe. You should have did all that from the beginning. Figure out who the house belonged to or get the number from him and call the fucking people. Because there's somebody in there. The fuck? This is 505. Yes. She said she's stepping outside. See, I can't be no I'm too fucking lazy. <laughs> I'm too motherfucking lazy. You talk to the shit. 72? All oh, that goddamn walking and running and shit. Uh-uh. Mm-mm. They can be like, ma'am, you don't never arrest nobody? Hell no. What happened? You they know ran. that gentleman? Back you didn't You didn't you get chased? Yeah. Fuck does, no. Does he have <laughs> he right there. Okay, does he have permission here to be watering flowers? He may because, um... And we remember her from the last... They are friends. Okay. And they went out of town today. So right. He may be watering their flowers. Okay. It'd be completely normal. Okay, that's is fine. that that's Please, that's yeah. fine. If he would have said, "Hey, I got this," gave his identification because he's a suspicious person. But um, how is he suspicious? He says that's not his vehicle. It's, it's their vehicle. Okay. We were called. Like, yeah. We're, we're here okay. because we're called here. I don't know who called, but somebody did. Oh my God! How is he suspicious? Because he's black. He an old black man. He ain't got on no hoodie. He ain't got no weapons. He ain't got his head covered up. He ain't he ain't got on no baggy clothes. He an old ass black man watering fucking flowers. He said his name, Pastor Jennings. He said he used to be a police officer. Like how is what about him is suspicious? Other than him being black, y'all can't it, make it make sense. Make it make sense. It'd be different if that nigga had on the full like black. Hoodie, all kind of shit, hiding his face and shit, doing suspicious moves, or just walking around the house, no water hose. Like, nothing about him looks suspicious, other than the fact that he's black. And whoever the fuck called, all they had to say was, it's a black man outside. That That's equivalent to suspicious. Black person, suspicious. That's equivalent to them.
dumb shit. Did you call us? Trigger team. Jabori Milam of Childersburg on a 2004 Chevy Tahoe. No color listed. Registration is valid till 630 of 22, negative 29. Tiffany, you did say the name's Roy Mallon. Temple. Tiffany, thanks for my mix up. Yeah. Temple. Um, yeah, he lives right there and he would be watering their flowers. This is probably my fault. Okay. Do you know who Roy Mallon is? That's that's the person that owns that vehicle. Roy Mallon. Roy Mallon. I, owns the house. I don't know the guy's name. Did you call? I don't know who owns it's probably it could be their vehicle. Can you uh, Step out. Miss uh, Sister Connie and uh what you, what's wrong with you? My cuffs are a little bit tight if y'all mind loosen them up. He oh setting up our Squarespace online what store was really this shit like goddamn and I haven't seen this yet, so I'm watching it with y'all. Listen to me, man. Y'all can really just take the better. Oh, he ain't gonna lie. Listen, let, let, let me talk to you. Who is Roy Milam? That's you, ain't it? I'm Michael Jennings, sir. You're Michael Not Jennings. You, right? Who is Roy Milo? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, that's who that vehicle belongs to. Yeah, that's who all I know his name is Roy. That's who lives here? That's Roy. I call him Roy and call his wife Connie, and I've been dealing with him for seven years that I've yeah. been living here. They are friends. Right, yeah. Okay. So you called not because of the car, but because you thought you saw someone besides him. Right, I didn't know it was him. Yeah, he, I got to keep that. their flowers watered. I got to keep their flowers watered so while they're down. Yeah. You okay. Yes. And by the way, I won't get to come to the graduation, but we're going to give you sign something. No, don't listen, yeah, listen, don't listen, do listen, so. listen to me, man. Listen to me. Anytime the police come out and they say, yeah, yeah. we want to identify you, you have to identify us. That's some black, that's some real black Southern shit right there. Because he could easily be pissed the fuck off that that white lady called the fucking cops on him. But instead, he's sitting there worried about her son graduation. That's some all Southern black shit for your ass. Like, my grandparents, they have gone and passed now, but that that's the type of shit that they did. It's like, whatever you did to them, it didn't matter. They were always, I, I respect it because it didn't, it resonated with me, but it didn't resonate the way it should have. But their thing was, it don't matter what other people do to you, your response always should be positive. Now, they was protective over me, <laughs> but they was in their 70s, like they grew up in the 30s. So it don't matter. Like this stuff, this is stuff that they used to. And that's what I was saying in my other video in the comments. It's like when you grow up in that era, that's why he not mad. Like had that been a younger black person, they would have been mad. They would have been doing the fucking most, blah, blah, blah. But he's older. He's dealt with way more worse shit than this. So it's like at the end of the day, I ain't worried about, I ain't mad at you for calling the cops. Like we have been there, done that. I'm still going to hook your son up for graduation. Like, because at the end of the day, I'm still a pastor and I still have to do things the way that they're supposed to be done. Baby, they get all my respect. Because there's a reasonable suspicion. There's a reasonable man. There's a vehicle. There, there's a reasonable suspicion that you're here. It's not a crime. If you, if you would have said, yeah, here's my name. Here's everything. We were like, okay. You told him my name. You didn't tell me your name. I decided, he asked me who I was. You didn't give it to me when I first asked. Pastor Jennings. Pastor Jennings. That's not a name. That's a pastor. Yeah. I need your name. He did give you his name. Jennings. Listen, <laughs> the and we're not the <laughs> no, sir. No, sir. We're not about that. I told you I was here wanting to fly. Hey. How do I know that's the truth? Anybody I had water hose in my hand. I was going to fly. Anybody can pick a hose pipe up. He is going to be so pissed when I tell him I got arrested. One of his flowers. Don't tell Seven me years. anybody look, can pick up a We got that. Let's sit back in here. That don't even make sense. Give me. So we can get this going on the ball. If he was robbing the house. Who the fuck robs a house and picks up a fucking watering hose and start watering the flowers? Come on now. He, and he wasn't in nobody's rush. And he kept watering the flowers when y'all started talking to him. Like, at this point, y'all reaching. 
Y'all, y'all are motherfucking reaching at this point. I mean, I've been right. walked away from that shit. What is your uh, social? I ain't got shit to do. They some bored ass cops. Give me your social. All that shit is too much. I'd have been like, all right, bro, you watering the flowers. Fuck it. Don't man get me in the system for no reason. All right, what's your name? Hey, the girl already told you who I am. Okay, yeah. I'm Michael yes. Jennings. That's all you Michael know. Michael Jennings. Michael Jennings. Spell Jennings. your first name. M I C H A E L. Now, hold on. Because I don't get a reason. Jennings, J E N N I N G S. G S. What's your date of birth? 11766. 11766. Oh, 1766. Your social to nobody, bitch. Sit in the car for me. I'm yes, going to make you worse. You want my social? Well, you want to look at me? Can I let the woman? It's hot. Yeah, will you let the woman down a little bit for him? Yeah, I'm trying to suffocate the man and shit. Yeah, I'm just going to. Yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to see the charge of, uh, I guess, disorderly conduct, the failure to obey a police officer. He refused to give any. Man, I got, that's He said he's not going to give me a social, but he gave me his name and date of birth. Okay, and she's saying the same thing. She won't give her name. Huh? Yeah, because she, she got arrested. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, because she knows she fucked up. So, we'll just go by the uh, computer on there. Disorderly conduct. Okay. That ain't sh I, I went to jail for disorderly conduct. That's some shit that they make up when they ain't got nothing else to say. Like, right. And he said, I'm talking to him like a boy. I said, if you'll just listen to me, I'll be an audio and video recorder. What you're trying to do is identify yourself and what's going on here. He wouldn't even let me. He wanted to yell over me and say we're racial profiling. I'm because you are. He's a boy. Nobody was doing that. Yes, you were. Yes, back. you were. I hate these old side ass conversations they be having. Nigga, you was racially profiling. Don't fucking lie. All of y'all was. Y'all full of shit. That disorderly conduct ain't gonna hold you. That is a bullshit ass misdemeanor. I literally sat in jail for four days and sat that shit out. Ain't on my record or nothing. Disorderly fucking cut. Failure to obey a police officer. Man, get your ass on. Boy, the congregation for the bill here by in like two seconds if y'all take him to jail. It's going to be a whole uproar in the community. I gave you all of this, Ellie! I don't do ads. Come on now. We don't pay for YouTube premium around here. No, no, no. That's what we not going to do. 10 for I got a name and date of birth. Michael Jennings. It's gonna be January 17th, 1966. Now he was born in the 60s. Oof. Cut this water off. The water melts not outrageous. For him to be born in 66, he actually like look pretty good. My mama was born in the 60s. Child, my man, thank you. He look, he gives, he gives me more like 60s though. But shit, if he used to be a police officer, he probably had a hard ass life. Shit, he's tired. He had, the water was on. Duh, bitch. The water was on when y'all walked up. Oh, my God. The water was on when y'all walked up, dummy. 313 years. Tell you about name and name of Michael Jennings. 117 of 66. Returns with the oil. I still the mic, negative 20 ounces. 243, if I max out. He's close. Careful. Pull him up on move. No, I got his old lid now. Yeah. He's doing the same thing, but her name and phone number is going to be on notes. Is it now? It will be. She's going to call 911. Brandon knows her pretty well. Where's it at? Suspicious view. They all know each okay, other and shit. This a whole setup. Yeah. If we have to get her last name, all we gotta do is go by and run her tag. What's she running for? I have no idea. 
Why sh shouldn't be anyone at the residence? Okay. I mean, this could have been all aboard if he would have just. Well, I told her that. And every time I try to tell him, he <coughs> says, You good, man. I appreciate this. I, I appreciate this. You know, because all he does is racial profiling, he's suing. That's all he would say. You couldn't talk to well, him. Well, I didn't, wasn't going to detain him until he, he walked away, started coming to the front yard saying he's coming to water these plants. And then he gets his phone out and he just keeps speeding walking away. And I said, Okay, fine. Come here. Because <coughs> he's trying to call so he can tell y'all that he didn't supposed to be there. What's the charge? Is that just destruction? Just a little wheel. I'll just do, a, just do a structure. Obstruction of governmental operations. Of yeah. governmental operations. What are you? <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. They just pull this shit out their ass at this point. <laughs> like, nigga, is you serious right now? Obstruction of governmental operations. If you get your bitch ass on, that's how you know they fucked up when they sitting there trying to figure out a charge. Like, they coming over some shit. Like, all right, what we gonna do? Like, we gotta pick one. <laughs> what? Nigga. Still, I need his name. You know, we, we gotta have to I'm so yeah. sick of this shit. If this ain't the most racist shit out of the ever seen. For you. No, yeah, I'll go get gas. If there's no, uh, in the bond book, if it's not listed, you just do the lowest one, the 500. Look, he don't the even know if it's listed. That way we won't be overcharging or anything like that. They trying to say they they coming up with a whole yeah, huddle nice plan. Guy. I don't understand. Yeah. To say they ain't. He shouldn't. He, if he's a good water police, he said this ain't an identif identifying state. Yes, it is. Well, I mean, I it doesn't matter if he's a pastor or if he's a pastor or not. Like, the thing is, he's he a nice enough, reasonable guy. Yeah. Just talk to us, man. Like, I'm, he did talk to you. Yeah. He yeah. told yeah. you he's water in the flowers. He had a whole conversation. I'm telling you, we're 24 staff. Okay. That's my okay. dog. Damn so your wife. Right, you're good. You're good. So we got to call. Hold on. His they wife is coming. So you, so you can do this once. That's fine. Okay. That's fine. Oh, his daughter look like she going to raise hell, too. She got I looked out the door, Daddy. I was wondering where you were. Yeah. I thought she was outside. No, don't cover the camera up. Move your hand. I told her I don't have to identify myself. I had to make a plan. She came over and told them that I was, she made a mistake and they still want to try to do something to get about the church. I did not know Okay. okay. I'll tell you what's okay, going on. Okay. And, 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 and so we got a call here. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, we'll okay. need us. We'll need his ID. I'm just gonna take his ID, and we're gonna. Well, we're just. Daddy. Want us to take his Do whole wallet, or just to give no, your ID? I just wanted you to know. No, 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 okay. No, no, that's fine. No, okay. That's fine. Okay. Um, if you don't give me an ID and we don't have a way to identify him, I will have to look him up John Doe. But if, if he's got it, then that's fine. Okay. Yeah, so, he's okay. I, so he's um, been identified. I'll he's identified himself. Oh, She's identified here. him and verified who yeah. he is and where he lives. I'm the missionary. So. But when we get here, of course, we're going to immediately okay. investigate the call. Yes. Yeah. Find him on scene. All he's doing is watering the plants, and that's not a problem. That's what do you want? What do you want to do? And we say, hey, sir, we have a call here. What do you want to see? Need you to identify yourself, please. Like, no, I'm not. Come on, Paul. I got that lady in the back. The missionary, the deaconess, <laughs> she finna call some hell on them goddamn officers. She is the one that's gonna gather every congregant of the church, okay? Vision of Abundant Life Ministries is the name of the church. I can see the little bit in the description. She gonna be the one. She gonna be the one, and that daughter ain't with the shits. Like, that daughter is not with the shit. The wife giving over the wallet, the daughter like, nah, daddy, what, you want to have it or nah? Give me that. <laughs> Give me that. My daddy don't want y'all to have it. You ain't going to have it. See, that, that'd be me. Identify me, so on, and he began to walk away. Okay. He, he just, we were listening, walking away, so okay. of course we're detained. So we, we don't know what's going on. Gotcha. After that, we radioed for them to contact her, have her step out, and talk to us. Well, she does tell us it's, it's a mistake yes. and all that stuff. But at this point, oh he's already God. collected the charge. We Once we place him on arrest, we can't. She come, because my grandma would have been like, hell no. This is so simple. And the neighbor just told him this morning, please water the plants and, and he's, take care of them. He said that, but it was all house. afterwards. It was all afterwards. Yeah. And all we told him was, like, if you're here to water the plants, that's okay. Just please No, he didn't say that afterwards. Name and let us call the owner. He didn't he say didn't that afterwards. You lying. Because when you first walked up, you said, one of y'all said, what you doing? And he said, watering the plants. And then they said, is that your church? Do you live here? So you lying. He told you from the jump when you first walked up what he was doing. So, I don't want to hear that bullshit. Try it again. So, 
So uh, what do we need to do now? What he do? He, he, he's going to he's gonna go to the Chillsburg Police Department. We're going to process the arrest report. It's going to be one charge for uh, obstruction of our investigation. He'll go to the jail. He can bond out immediately. You can get your bond, maybe 10% of the bond. So it'd be like $50. We're not investigating a crime. We're investigating a call. And we have a right to identify anybody involved in that call. He's, he's walking away and yelling at us and telling us he has no we have no Girl, shut the, the fuck up because it's your but fault that they ain't even in that shit. Yeah. Shut, why are you even still out there? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma I hope she feel like shit, old dumbass bitch. It's your motherfucking fault. And they can let him go. They don't have to arrest him. They just being assholes at this point because they didn't did all that work. So they don't want to look stupid. So now they're going to send him huh. to the jail, arrest him, and he can bond out immediately when you could just let him go right there. Right. Just we got to go. Like, y'all being childish and fuck. Like, this shit pissing me off. Because y'all sitting there letting him talk to his people and shit. Y'all really like, come on now. Yeah, just let the man go. Oh my god. Okay, that was the end of that. You know what? I'm not gonna even shut the fuck up. <laughs> it's another video that came out. I don't even know what that nigga was saying, but I got mad. That whole thing was racial profiling. I don't give a fuck how you wanna name it or claim it. You niggas was racially profiling him. He is an old black man that was watering flowers. You should have just fucking let him go. Like, y'all coming up with these bullshit-ass charges. Y'all doing all this unnecessary shit. Come on, bro. Like, all that wasn't even necessary, but that's all right. Because when he get out, it's going to be a motherfucking problem. He going to be a force to be reckoned with. First of all, he a pastor. You don't fuck with nobody's pastor. Okay? Because they got what you call congregants, deacons, deaconesses, motherboards, sisters, brothers, ministers. You don't, you don't want to do that. They roll deep. They serious about their pastor. Like, and the daughter look like she'll start a ride in any second. Like, come on, bro. Like, y'all got to chill. Y'all out here. But it's Alabama of all motherfucking places. So why am I not surprised? I'm definitely not surprised. This is the type of shit that they do, especially in the South and especially in the fuck Alabama. So we not surprised at all. But I just want to watch the body cam footage with y'all. Um, I was going to watch it by myself, and I was like, ah, I might as well watch it with my viewers. So this video was a little long, but we had a watch party, though. Because y'all could have easily went to go pull it up yourselves, but it ain't as fun because you watching it with me. So it's, like, much better that way. Um, I am on to the next video. Finna do some reactions out this mug. So if you see me in this same getup, then that mean I just did it. Okay, I'm trying to get the videos out for next week because it's Sunday. All right? So until the next video, I will see y'all later. Bye.